There is no evidence that the incidents in Ethiopia and Indonesia are linked. Ethiopian Airlines Flight 302 lost contact six minutes after taking off from Bol International Airport in the Ethiopian capital and crashed about 65 kilometers away. Airline officials say the pilot was among the company's most experienced. Ahmed Nur Mohammed Nuri pilot Mohammed Nur Mohammed is an Ethiopian Airlines staff member. He has had more than 200 flight hours. After receiving the aircraft, we did the first maintenance check on February 4, 2019. It was a new and clean aircraft. Kenya's transport minister said Sunday 149 passengers and eight crew members were killed in the crash. We can now confirm that there were at least 35, at least 35 nationalities. And I'm saying at least because as of now, two are unknown. So um, among the most affected, as you may expect, is Kenya, which had about 32 passengers on board out of the 149 passengers. Canada lost 18 nationals on the flight, Ethiopia nine, the United States, China and Italy eight each, France and Britain seven each, and Egypt six. There were also passengers from Austria, India, Ireland, Israel, Morocco, the Netherlands, Russia, Poland, and Sweden. Ethiopian Airlines is one of the biggest carriers on the continent. The plane that crashed is one of six Boeing 737 MAX 8 jets it has ordered. Boeing unveiled the new model in 2017, promoting it as a fuel-efficient and technologically advanced upgrade to its popular 737 series. The second crash of the new model in a little more than four months is drawing intense scrutiny as more than 350 such aircraft are flying worldwide. Zlarica Hoke, VOA News, Washington.